Okay, so I purchased all these cute designs on Etsy and I will link all of them down below. So we're gonna jump right into the video and I like to outline all my sticker designs. So I'm gonna show you this stitch one that I did. I uploaded it to Procreate and I'm just adjusting the angle right here. And I'm going to add another layer and move it at the bottom of the first layer and I'm gonna go ahead and start outlining the design. And I'm using Procreate on my iPad and using my Apple Pencil. So as soon as I'm done outlining all my designs, I'm gonna go ahead and upload them to Cricut Design Space. Okay, so I'm adding all my images to Design Space. This pumpkin design had multiple layers, so I clicked on the Mickey pumpkin and flattened all those layers so I can use the print and cut feature. And I'm just gonna adjust the sizes. I want all my images to be about three to four inches. So as soon as I'm done, I'm gonna go ahead and click make it and print them out. For the base material, I chose printable sticker paper in white. And thank you to Koala for sending me these two holographic sticker papers. Um, the, for the first part, I'm going to use the vinyl rainbow sticker paper. And for the second part, I'm going to use this starry holographic printable sticker paper. I usually use white, so I was so excited to use these, something different and I was not disappointed. So there I cut the first part of my stickers with the rainbow holographic paper and I think they came out so good. I love the shine to it. I'm so glad they sent me this paper because I will be ordering more and I will link the information down below where you can purchase them. And so now for the second part, I'm using the starry holographic paper for my pumpkins. And here they are all done. You can see the star shining through. And there are the rest of the pictures or the stickers. So cute. Well, thank you for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next one.